the positive of the blessing of this guy is that when I was trying with the softball team, um, we started meeting a lot of kids that were coming to these games uh, because they heard about the local town heroes playing softball, come out and watch them. And so back when we started the team in 2012, we were getting like one or two kids and we'd make them the bat boy or the bat girl and kind of let them hang out. And a couple of years in, I, I hang out with this kid and I, I urge you, you know, to write this name down, Landis Sims. Landis Sims is now like 16 years old. I've known him since he was like six. He was born with a rare congenital disease and he's missing both arms and both legs. And the kid wants to be a baseball player. When I'm, when I say he's a good baseball player, I mean, he's a damn good baseball player. Um, and we're at a camp one year and he tells me, I've never felt comfortable in my whatever years it was, like eight, nine years old he was. I never in my life felt comfortable wearing shorts until I met you guys. And that fucking hit me in the chest like you, like with a sledgehammer. So the blessing has been that I've been able to have a platform to talk to numerous organizations, be a part of numerous organizations, uh, be the spokesperson for organizations, uh, to try to you know, promote good you know, mental health, good physical health, um, good camaraderie within law enforcement, military, and just, you know, bring positivity to the table in a world where, you know, the negativity just can't hide. It just seems like negativity is hitting us from every single direction, whether it's financial, medical, emotional, you know, whatever, whatever it may be. So I just try to leave this house every day and I just try to impact one person and give them a little bit of hope that, you know, whatever they're going through that day, it's going to be all right. 